Hey everyone, it's Susie with Dragonfly Bees. I'm an online reseller, primarily in jewelry, among other things, such as Barbies. In this video, I'm continuing my Barbie pop-up sale, and these Barbies have not been listed online just yet, but I want to offer them to you here at subscriber discounted rates. If there's anything that you find of interest in purchasing, all you need to do is email me at dragonflybees at gmail.com. Shipping is also discounted. I'm only charging $5 for smaller boxes and $8 for the larger ones. I'll pay the difference. So, with that said, Let's see what more Barbies I have. Okay, to kick off the second half of this Barbie series, I'm going to show you the Enchanted Seasons collection. This uh, here is the Snow Princess. This box, this Barbie, is from 1994. Uh, it's a series where um, there's a Barbie for each season. So this one here is the first, first one in this collection. And here she is. She is the Snow Princess. She has a big poofy gown, white with gold sequins. She's a, she's a cutie. Look at her with the dangly drop earrings. Never removed from box. Let's look at the back. There's the story of the Winter Princess. Oh no, Snow Princess Winter Edition. So she's first in this series from 1994. The second doll from the Enchanted Seasons collection is the Spring Bouquet Barbie. There's a crease here. There's a crease all along the, the left side of the box. This doll is also from 1994. There's another crease on the bottom right. Ah. I took off the nails. My hands, the, my nails needed to breathe. So please, ugh, disregard. Uh, Spring Bouquet Barbie, 1994. Here's a sneak peek. She's the second in this series. So let's take a look at this one. Okay, come on. Whoa. Okay. Okay, here's her little bonnet. And here she is. Blondie. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful girl. All the spring flowers. The next doll in this series is Autumn. They skipped summer. Summer's next. Uh, this box has a tear in the front, um, but this one is the Autumn Glory Barbie. This box is from, she is from 1995. So let's take a look at the rest of the box. A little crease here. Minor, minor crease here. And there she is. So, third in the series. Let's take a look at her. Wow. 
I think she's my favorite out of all the seasons. Look at her. Auburn hair. Pretty, pretty earrings. Great big hat with a feather. And this gorgeous gown. So this here is Seasons Collection. All right, next we have the last season, which is Summer, Summer Splendor. Summer Splendor Barbie is from 1996. So yeah, they skipped, you know, they went from winter, spring, autumn, and now summer. So this box, take a look, has, has a line going across the top. back I mean the side and this is a, a little description in the back and there she is so she is the fourth in this series so let's take a look at her open her up and there she is she's a pretty little southern belle has a bright bright yellow dress on with the bonnet and her lace long elbow length gloves with the really pretty gown with some um, white velvet flowers design so yeah this one is summer splendor uh, so she's the last of the uh, enchanted seasons collection Next, we have Barbie Had a Little Lamb from 1998. She's from the Nursery Rhyme Collection. So look at her with the curls and the pretty blue dress. And a little lamb. This box has some um, issues where the scallop portions are. So there's some bends there. Um, and I see some up here. I guess that's where the price tag was. The top is, um, <clears throat> plastic. Here's the sides. And there's her little description. Oh, so they changed up the rhyme to include Barbie's name. <clears throat> All right, here's the other side. And let's take a quick look at the bottom. Here's the bottom. So yeah, Barbie had a little lamb. Um, this is the first in this series. So she is um, from 1998. Barbie had a little lamb. Okay, next Barbie is Sleeping Beauty. She's from the children's um, collector series. And uh, that's from 1997. So here she is. Look how long her hair is. Beautiful gown. Yep. Sleeping Beauty slept for 100 years. Really? Um, blonde. Top is plastic. Let's look at the box. That's the right side. Here's the other side, and the back. Children's Collector Series, Sleeping Beauty. There's the bottom. And there she is. She's pretty, very pretty. Barbie. 
Sleeping Beauty. Next up we have this doll from the Society Style Collection. It is called the Radiant Rose Barbie, second in this series. Uh, the box has some issues on the top. There's a crease over there. There's a little um, nick over here. <clears throat> That's one side. Here's the back. And here's the right side. And the bottom. This Barbie is... Um, from 1996, it is the second in the series. Has a little Velcro cover opening. And there she is. And there she is. Wow. Um, <clears throat> red velvet dress. Poofy with red roses. Well, she is called Radiant Rose. So, let's see if I could bring her closer. There you go. Look at her. Radiant Rose Barbie from 1996 Society Style Collection. So, what do you think so far? Something different. I figured, let me uh, show my Barbies. Look at this beauty. She's one of my favorites. It's um, the first in the series of the great fashions of the 20th century. And this is from, I guess, 1910. She's called Promenade in the Park Barbie, and she is from 1997. So, here she is. Has a parasol. Really pretty outfit on. Pearls. Beautiful black bonnet with the huge white blooms. Um, like I said, Promenade in the Park, Barbie, uh, great fashions of the 20th century, and this would be from the 1910s. She has a parasol. The box is in, there's a, it's, hmm, that looks like a, t a crease. There's swans. Let's take a look. Okay, a crease on top, a crease over here, one there. These Barbies have moved, like I said, a couple times. Do you remember KB, that toy store? She was $59.99. There's the back. She has a little description. Here's the other side. First in this series... Promenade in the Park, Barbie, from 1997. She's, she's a beaut. Here's another Barbie from 1998. Look at the fashion she's wearing. She's an animal-loving Barbie. Exciting safari fashion and fun. Um, 1998, so wow, she's 23 years old. There was a price tag on it for twelve ninety seven. Wow. Um, here's the top. There's the side. She's got big hair. There's the other side. The bottom. And here she is with her friends. And they all have. <laughs> Ken has a chimpanzee, Nikki has a lion cub, and Barbie has the panda bear. And that's ZZ, the zebra. Oh well. Safari friends. Okay, this is a 1998 animal loving. 
Barbie. Next up is this Walmart Barbie, made especially for Walmart. Um, it's called Portrait in Blue. She has auburn hair, long and wavy. She's from 1997, has this beautiful blue gown on with blue and gold. Portrait in Blue Barbie. Let's look at the box. <laughs> there she is in the back. The portrait. So, yes. Walmart Special Edition Portrait in Blue Barbie. Next we have this big box. And um, this was uh, the Couture collection. And it was designed by Robert Best. Uh, this doll is from 1996. There was a price tag of 135 back in 99. She was um she's called Portrait in Taffeta. Yeah, that's it. Portrait in Taffeta. I got to say the box is not the great greatest. And I just wish, you know, a doll like this, they would have put it in a better um, box. Because if you see, you got to open it. And then there's this cardboard. And then you pull it out. And she's in cardboard. You have this. That's what she looks like. I guess that's the the rendering by Robert Best. And it's just a a sheet of cardboard. And then this is how she comes. She's in a cardboard box. Not even in a display box. But look at her. Wow. Beautiful black satin gown what is she called portrait and taffeta big updo style there's her gown i mean she's gorgeous um from 19 what did i say 96 1996 couture collection but she needs a case, um, like a doll display case. But look at her. What a beauty. So here I have the um, Dolls of the World um, collector dolls from the Princess Collection. Uh, these are from 2002, 2003. I did have the ones, the dolls from Italy and Ireland and I think some other European country, but those were sold. And these are the ones I have left. Um, she's from Japan. This one is Portuguese and this one is from China. So let's go over these. Barbies. Okay, first one from the Dolls of the World Princess Collection is this um, beauty from China. She has this long satin um, traditional dress on. She is from 2002. So, I guess that makes her 19. Um, 2002. Box looks okay. Yeah, she looks pretty good. And there she is. 
Next is uh, the princess from Japan. You notice on the front of this particular box, there's all these other um, languages. This one's a, um, it's not, this was not purchased in the United States. This was, um, it's, that's why it has all the multi-language print on her. So she was an import. Um, this one's the Japanese princess. Uh, she's wearing kimono. There's a box. Yeah, you see all the different um, translations for Princess of Japan. Here's the other side. Let's take a look at the back. Even the back has the description in multiple languages. Oh, yeah. Okay, so here are the other ones that I was talking about. Um, so I guess there were six others in this series. Okay. Princess of Japan. Uh, this one is also from 2002. Next we have this lovely, oh my God, she's gorgeous. She, um, there are some creases on the top. She's also an import because if you notice all the different languages on the top of the box, she is the princess of the Portuguese empire. From the Dolls of the World Princess Collection. Look at her. Wow. Um, take a look at the sides. Um, there's a description also in multiple languages. And this beauty is from 2003. So... What is she? Uh, 2003. 18 years old? Really pretty. Okay, next Barbie. I think this is the newest one I have in my collection because she is from 2010, um, which only makes her 11 years old. She is the um, Dylan's Candy Bar Barbie. And Dylan's Candy Bar, there's one in New York City here, and it was founded by um, Dylan Loren. So, yeah, look at her in her funky outfit. Beautiful hair with highlights. And she even has that candy necklace on and the big swirly lollipop. Uh, there's the top. There's the side. Oh, okay. So that is um, Dylan Loren. So that's what she looks like. She's the one that started this candy biz. There's the back. Little description on how, I guess, Dylan's candy bar came to be. So, yeah, here's the Dylan candy bar, Dylan's candy bar Barbie from 2010. So last Barbie in this segment will be this special Millennium Edition Barbie. She has a beautiful blue velvet gown on with silver embellishments, lace. She is the Millennium Princess. Beautiful, blonde, classic Barbie with the uh, tiara and the really pretty choker necklace, statement necklace. And she's holding a um, keepsake ornament 
which is the Happy New Year 2000 um, crystal, faux crystal ball. Um, she is 21 years old. Um, here's the top. See a little, uh, that's nothing. Very minor. Spin her around. That's the back. There is a sticker. Here's the sides. It's the other side. She even, I even have the original box that it was shipped in. She's been in the box, in the closet. All my dolls have been in the closet. I gotta get them out of the closet and have someone else enjoy them. Um, yeah, this is the original box that came in and it was from the manufacturer because this is Millennium Barbie on it. I don't know how they could ship it that way because, oops, sorry. I would be so paranoid about it not having any padding and uh, for the doll to get um, damaged. But yeah, this is the Millennium, ah, Millennium Barbie year 2000. And she wraps up this part two of my Barbie pop-up sale. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, video. Please hit the like button. If there's anything that you are interested in purchasing, just email me at dragonflybees at gmail.com. Just for these Barbies, all you need to do is, is tell me the description, which Barbie it was, since they all have different... Um, names and uh we'll take it from there so thank you so much for spending this time with me and my barbies and i'll see you in the next one which will most likely be back to jewelry so oh if you haven't subscribed please do i would really appreciate it and um i'll see you in the next one bye